everyone, I'm Nitin and today in this PSLE 2020 Paper 2 question series, I'll be going through question 11. In my channel, I aim to help all of you master all those concepts out there, okay? So let's jump straight into question 11. Okay, this is question 11 and this question is testing us on rates and time, okay? So let's read the question first for part A. The photocopying rates of two machines, P and Q, are shown. So this is P, 2 pages per second, and this is Q, 7 pages every 5 seconds, okay? Both machines were used to make a copy of a set of notes, which had been divided into part 1 and part 2. Machine P took 7 minutes to photocopy part 1, and machine Q took 8 minutes to photocopy part 2. Part A. How many pages were there altogether in the set of notes? Okay, so let me highlight the key information. Photocopying rates of two machines. Two pages per second and seven pages every five seconds. And this is Q and P. Both machines were used to make a copy of set of notes which have been divided into part one and part two. Machine P took seven minutes, part one. Machine P took eight minutes to photocopy part two. How many pages were there all together in the set of notes? Okay, so in order to find the total number of pages in the set of notes, right, it's basically set of notes equals P plus Q, okay, which is 7 minutes and 8 minutes, okay? So this is basically what we need to find. First, let's move on to finding P. So P took 7 minutes, right? And we know 1 minute is equal to 60 seconds. So in order to find 7 minutes, basically took 420 seconds because of 60 seconds times 7, which will give us 420 seconds. So we know per second is 2 pages printed, right? So 420 seconds times 2, which will give us 840 pages. For part E, this is for P. After that, we can move on to finding Q, okay? So basically, we found P for 7 minutes, right? After that, we must find Q for 8 minutes. So Q took 8 minutes to print part 2. And we know 8 minutes is equal to 60 seconds times 8, which is 480 seconds. Okay, I'm going to take this 480 seconds divided by 5 first, because that is every 5 seconds. So it will give us 96. So I'm going to use this 96 times 7 pages, okay? So it will give us 672 pages. And in order to find the total number of pages in the set of notes, we just need to add these two up. 672 plus 840. So it will give us 1,512. So 840 plus 672, it will give us 1,512 for answer part A. Okay, now for part B. Part B, let's read the question first. Another copy of the same set of notes was made using machine Q only. So, instead of using machine P, they only use machine Q. So, it's the same set of notes. So, it has 1512 answer, okay? 1512 pages as well. How many minutes did machine Q take? Okay, just like this, instead of taking 96 times 7, right? I'm going to do the opposite. I'm going to take 1512 divided by 7, which will give us 216. Because they are asking us for the time, not the number of pages this time. So I'm going to, we must do the opposite way. So we have to take 216 times 5 this time instead of dividing 5. Okay? It will give us 1080 seconds. And in order to find the number of minutes, because they are asking us in minutes, we need to convert 1080 seconds into minutes. It will, so we need to take 1080 seconds, divide by 1 minute in second, which is 60 seconds. It will give us the answer in minutes. So the answer for part B is 18 minutes. Okay, so this question is testing us on rates and time. And I hope you understood my explanation for part A and part B. Okay, so thank you and bye-bye. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.